Hi ladies, so in this email, um, in this video, I'm just gonna quickly show you how to set up a um, template ready for sending out for asking your subscribers to re, um, re opt in or give their permission again um, under the GDPR um, rulings. So go to, um, in the templates, go to create template. And go to themes and right at the bottom, you'll find a GDPR subscriber alert. Choose that one. I'm just gonna go back because I've already set one up. So I'm just gonna edit mine. Once you've got that open, you can make the changes just like you normally would, add in your logo, um, your branded colors, you know, using design, you can do all the usual things that you would normally do. Um, here's the standard text if you want to use that. Obviously, you don't have to. Um, you can write whatever you like in here and make it more branded to suit you. Um, this bit here, you can change the colors and so forth and the style to make it um, more branded. but don't change the actual information in it and this tag, because that's what will update the profile when somebody clicks on it. So instead of update, say settings, um, you can put that wherever, yes, I'm in, or um, something a bit more kind of call to action-y um, that might suit your, your brand in a bit more in the way that you would normally talk to your clients. Um, so save and exit that template. Go to campaigns, create a new campaign. Again, I'm just gonna edit this because I've started it. Um, design your email, go to your saved templates that we've just created. And add that in. So make sure you update the forms on your list so that when someone goes through using this template that MailChimp have set up for the re-permission email, they've got um, the segments that you've provided. So in my case, it was top tips, um, offers and discounts, and what was it, freebies and value. So they can then select which ones they wanna be kept up to date from. And obviously they've got the unsubscribe um, section at that. Then they'll all go into your segments that you created um, in the same way in the previous video. Um, and next time you send an email, you'll be able to just send the preferences of what they've asked to hear more about. I hope that helps. Um, if you have any questions, just do let me know. Have a great day. Bye.